I haven't mentioned this before and I didn't think it was necessary uh, because it was a private conversation between me and Brother Isa Allah and uh, Brother Abu Ismail al-Farsi was with us and many other brothers were with us at that particular time so whoever wants to verify what I'm saying uh, no problem please go and speak to the brothers that were there uh, at the time about three to four months ago my last uh, visit no 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 my the, um, there was another visit to speakers concert. This was the one before this. Uh, Isa, as he always does, Allah Yerhamu, comes up to me, gives him salam, hugs me, and talks to me. And he hasn't met me since my back and forth with this ignorant fool. So, subhanAllah, look at the humbleness and look at the uh, advice that he gave me. He came up to me and he goes, Haji, I want to speak to you about this back and forth with Shamsi. And I said, brother, no problem. What, what's in your heart? Let me know. You know, pour out what's in your heart. He said, look, Haji. Do you know I was a part of them? SubhanAllah. And this is testimony with many brothers that were there. He actually said this to me. I said, Uqsan Bilal Adim. He said to me, I was a part of this cult. But as far as your back and forth with Shamsi, he advised me that, look, he's still your brother. You need to cut down the mocking. You need to cut down the insults. He actually advised me about this. What you presented, I incline towards what you've been saying. So when Shamsi uttered what he utters, it's because Isa Allah used to be a part of them and he's left a very bad taste in the mouth. All the comments that you heard was done out of personal resentment for uh, Brother Isa because he left their cult. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guided him and he left you guys. He ran away from you guys and he told me personally. So he said, Brother Haji, please cut down the insults, you know, do what you're doing, but just, you know, keep it respectable. He's still your Muslim brother at the end of the day. Subhanallah al -Azim. That's what Isa said to me, mate. You understand? And you've got the nerve to come out and publicly say, yeah, He had a lot of Muslims, Allahu Musta'an, Allahu Musta'an. Have some shame, have some dignity, have some honor, because that's what you're devoid of. And you can shout as much as you want about Da'wah to Salafiyah, mate. This is part of the problem. This same set mentality, mate, you're alienating yourselves from the Muslims, but you don't care. As long as your five cronies are upon haqq and you guys are saved and you have salvation by shouting salaf, salaf, salaf. You guys and the takfiriyun are two sides of the same coin. That the da'at of salafiyah are free from you and your likes. So I just want to make this video brief. Take care of yourselves. Wa ala Muhammad. And the books of Aqaid was not written yet.